Hey, here's another tip. Uh, you know, we have used command prompt on Windows for ages, and it served us very well. But now that we're working in a cross-platform world, frequently you run into projects that have Linux commands in them, or, you know, they work fine on a Mac. For instance, CP. Now, CP will work here, okay, because this is a different shell called Commander. It will not work in, let's say, com you know, your regular command prompt on Windows. Uh, now, what happens is that, and there are, you know, other things here, like, you know, I like Commander, how it shows this, uh, you know, what what branch you're on, your Git integration status, etc. So when I open this project in VS Code, and I, let's say, right-click, open in command prompt, you know, it opens this command prompt. Now, the older command prompt. Wouldn't it be nice if it could open this command prompt, or for that matter, any other terminal shell that you prefer? Luckily, that's configurable. Here's how you do it. You press F1, and then you type settings, and you go to the user settings. You can also do this in workspace, but why would you? So let's go to user settings. And then here, you basically create a setting called terminal dot external dot Windows exact for Windows OS X Linux. You get the idea. And here you specify the path to wherever your uh, you know preferred command prompt command prompt is. So it says comspec. That's your usually command prompt. Uh, that's uh, that's the Windows command prompt. But I'd like to use, you know, the C utils commander, commander.exe. So I'm going to say C utils commander, commander.exe. And that is a command prompt I would prefer to use. Just make sure that you use these double slashes so it understands what we're trying to tell it. And it's save. And now once you've done that, now I say right click open in command prompt. And you see that it opens that path in Commander or whatever shell you prefer.